Pocono Raceway, a two and a half mile racetrack that's no stranger to the season sweep. For instance, Jimmy Johnson swept both Pocono races in 2004, Denny Hamlin did it during his rookie season in 2006, Dale Jr. did it in 2014, and this year Ryan Blaney looks to back up his win in June and put the Wood Brothers back in victory lane for the 100th time in the Monster Energy NASCAR Cup Series. Kyle Busch had perhaps the best car at Pocono earlier in the year, but a late call in the race to stay out instead of pit kept him out of victory lane. Mix that in with an early exit at Indianapolis, no guaranteed spot in the playoff, and the 18 team should be laser focused this weekend. And what about Dale Earnhardt Jr.? We know he can win at Pocono, but in June trouble shifting the car was his Achilles heel. If the 88 can hit his marks and his shifts, Jr. should have a strong run this weekend. Now for the picks, NASCAR.com resident crew chief Chris Rice is going with the 78 of Martin Truex Jr. That team has a win here, and that came in 2015. But I'm going with another first-time winner this season, Chase Elliott. He will be the third Hendrick Motorsports car to make the playoffs with a win this weekend at Pocono. With your starting grid, I'm Jonathan Merriman.